Heading for gate number 10. That's our destination at the moment. Twenty third of December, twenty twenty one. We are on way to Australia. Well, we're in the spice, and uh, our daughter is waiting over there. We are also waiting to see her, and our nati as well. So let's just wait till we meet them. You ever see anything? This is just the beginning and we are gonna we're gonna do some more in the very near Food future. Food is good. Food is it's good? good? Yeah. Yes. We had uh, noodles and a little bit of burger and a no. little bit of uh, this soup. Okay, nice knowing you. Yeah, thank you, sir. Next time, come back again. Yes, we are. I'm always, I'm always here. Yes, sir. I, I was having. You a, take care. You have a very. Uh, you take care. You have a very journey. You will come back. Right. Yeah. Long journey. Right. Thank you. We have reached Singapore. This is the condition inside the flight. situation. Well, this is generally the situation every time you get on inside an aircraft. Well, we are at the airport right now. Is that Miss Mitul who will be driving right now? And uh, We'll move on. Um, I'll, I'll keep you connected. We'll come to the Sydney shopping area. And this is a nice one though. Too many shops around here. All sorts of uh, items, consumer items are available. You can grab them. So this is good. Yeah, this is nice. Now we're gonna we're gonna go to me uh, to Laura's house, and then from there we'll stay there for a few Hello. few uh, days for uh, for just stabilizing ourselves, and then we we'll move on with videos. So this is the house. So here we are, Laura Mitu's house, the new one. A new house, newly built, on land. Christmas Eve. Christmas is on. Night time. Dark outside. See the inside of the house, the huge house, anyway. And uh, 
There we are. Wow. We can see you, Nati. And beautiful. Can I hug? Got it. Inside of the house is well polished and everything. My grandson seems to be in deep sleep. For the rooms, and probably we'll be. Well, he hit the sack pretty soon. Well, night time, you know, sort of tired. Yeah, what a big house, man! It's a huge house. Huh? What a big house. Let me go out the pool after the heat. Room floor, everything. The room is big. The rooms are big rooms. It has toilets. Getting ourselves with everything around us. Kids still sleeping, deep sleep. Now we don't know what to do, but uh, I thought probably we're sort of hungry by now. But in any case, we'll have to wait for that. Okay, great. What a sight, it's like a dream. Oh, we can see the swimming pool. Slightly tall in size, but uh, anyway, it serves a purpose because we were into the water and uh, it was slightly warm outside. This is the Christmas cake. Meanwhile, we had to cut the cake beneath here. We were having sort of a fun with cakes and everything. We need explaining things. Okay. While the kid is sleeping, from time to time, his mother comes around. number he 
You can see the outside of the house, the green, and the backyard. Very green, while we were having fun in the swimming pool for some time. <laughs> Binny's kids were there. <laughs> it's warm outside. The water in the swimming pool seemed very good, very comfortable for us. Uh, we were having fun anyway. My water bed. Get out my water bed. Water bed. I hear the business kids come here every now and then. Isn't it nice that and, water uh, have a dip? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, this is the first time. It's good. Coming out good. Nice swimming pool. We are having a nice time. <laughs> <laughs> Window screen, you can see your <laughs> see your body. The, it works like a mirror. Okay. like a I'm a music chair. 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 I'm Dora's room. See the hills from Laura's room. From Laura's house. First floor. You can see the surroundings from here. From up here. Here. You know, Laura's, Laura's house. house. Kid. He's having a sleeping time again and resting. The neighborhood is quiet. Uh, that is calm. Not many people out there. It's just a. Uh, you can see the nice road leading up to the hills. Nice. All the way, probably. Environment. We will have to Overlooking go and find out where the road really leads down to. But Blue mountain, look at the hills. It looks so nice. Blue mountain ring. Every morning, every time you come out of the house, yeah. the hill really grips you with a feeling. You can see Laura's car on the left and Mitchell's car on the right. No, we not. On the left side, you can uh, walk down. That's what we did many times. Car and uh, it's good. Happy birthday to Zaire. Happy 
Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Laura. Happy birthday to you. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're walking towards the hill. Walking down the road. It's just walking down the road. Many times. Is the green in the only time is Christmas. Leads to straight to the hill. That's where we are going. Going to us. Three sisters. See the kid. They're all here. Probably watching something. All moving towards in the cart. Now we are not going towards a mountain. We are, in fact, we are. It's, it's a whole range, spread across Australia, Sydney, and. Uh, We will be reaching down the, to that place, down that place, uh, pretty soon. Mithul is on the driving side. His dad is on, on his left. Here you can see the uh, lush green trees on both sides of the road. It looks so good, blue sky. The club white clouds running down. What we are going through this atmosphere. Katumba Falls. And look at the, look at the sight. You know, it's a beautiful place. It's so different from ours. Just look at the eucalyptus all over the place. Eucalyptus, in fact, has a huge family, about 152 types. So it's very difficult to find out which one is real, which one is not. But all of them are real. Different kinds of eucalyptus. Some of them are acacia. But the trees really give me, really give me the, give me something. I don't know what. It really, I feel so good when I look at these trees. Some of the huge, most of them, trunks really. Bulging out, and uh, long, tall trees. They feel so good because they are part of life. And in that, in that midst, we are listening to some music. The 
It seems so desolate road, not too many people around because of the situation. It's dampened the spirits of human beings everywhere, I guess, on the whole earth. Katumba Falls Mountain Range where there is mountain, there is waterfalls because of the clouds, the rain comes down and the collected waters is slowly used out, down, down below, so creating a waterfalls, creating waterfalls, oh, I, mean, I mean so many ways, so many ways, so many Passes. But then, this is incredible when you look at the forest tree, forest all around, as I said, the beautiful trees behind her, the huge ones, and some of them are almost 100 to 150 years old. Laura is waiting for all of us come and walk down the path. Look at the tree on the right, eucalyptus, whitish, so huge. Walking towards the Katumba Falls. This place all around, you can just have a look at them can understand where you're really going. Everywhere you see all sorts of signs like this, anywhere you go, that will lead you to the right direction. This one did too. But since we had Dora and Mitu with us, they were directing us because they knew the place. the landscape. These, these roads are built a long time ago, say around 80 to 100 years, some saw them even beyond that, 150 years. All the plants are over here. You can have a look at them and think about where to go. Katumba. See the tracks. <coughs> See the green trees. Through the forest, down below, taking the steps. Even this place looks cool and calm. Not too many people around to crowd you. Oh, so we're going down, mm. which is about 200 meters. Mm. You get to see the waterfall from the bottom. Mm. And this is 50 meters up. Mm. You get to see the waterfall from up. Mm. But it's prettier from the bottom. From down there. Yeah. Okay. Both sides of the road. 
in numerous numbers of trees. Mm. Most of them, rare ones, never probably saw them before. Ferns, look at this one on the left, fern. And some of the ferns are so weird and weird and beautiful. I don't know, we uh, never have them in our country. Our soil is sort of different, maybe because of that. This soil is sort of hard and very, very, very old. Just because the soil is hard and old, they create lots of different sort of environment, different sort of situation, different sort of mixture in the soil, so that mm. creates a different kind of trees and ferns, plants. That's why. That's why sometimes these plants are different, one from the other, and uh, they're different in one continent than the other. Uh, we have mangoes, they have mangoes too. But different, not like ours, because of the soil. And it's uh, trees, excepting some of them are all rare to our eyes. we never seen anything like it. And this place belongs to three sisters, I mean, the mountain. Long, tall trees, ferns again, eucalyptus. These are small ones, very slender trees. And the walls of the mountains, solid. Solid stone. They have become stone over the years. Hundreds and hundreds and thousands of years behind before these mountains were there. Since then. Since then. They were underwater for a long, long time. When the water vanished, these plants and trees slowly cropped up. And look. The waterfall. Cascading down, creating an atmosphere of awe and surprise. But these days, you get all kinds of all kinds of falls like this everywhere else. But this one is slightly different than the others. Why? Because the mountain, no. solid mountain, okay. is uh, different. Three sisters. I can see the three sisters. They say that Grand Canyons. Brilliant. And brilliant. Oh, that. Yeah, look at that. Absolutely stunning view. Look at it. Here. It looks like Grand Canyon. But this it is, is not. Point. This is uh, and from Echo Point you can see the a different look. The uh, sun going down. Different atmosphere. Very desolate. It's just like uh, Grand Canyon. Sun going down they say slowly. That there are three of them 
about us, and you can see the tree tops. Some of them are red, some of them are slightly blackish. The tree trunks, they are of varied colors. While the sun is going down, it takes down the colors from the face of the trees, the tree trunks. You can hear the whistling sound of the whistling sound of the wind through the trees. They have created this for the people to watch. They come in and watch the wonderful sight of mountains all around you. It's called the Three Sisters. The Three Sisters, you can see. Probably these, these are the ones responsible for the name. Sisters here. <laughs> Look somewhat like Grand Canyon. Slowly are going home because the uh, sun is going down, and uh, the crowd really thinned a bit. <laughs> See, the sun is going down. <laughs> There's so many of them, not many of them, probably there are five like this, this gorgeous, this mountain, this landscape. There's one in the United States, it's called Grand Canyon. There's one in China. There's probably, most probably there are some more in some other areas. But this one has got its own charm. So we always come here, every time we come here, we come to this place and watch.